Ox line. We will cross the bridge in mass casualties. Let's go. Go. Vive la France. Vive la France. Back when I was just 17 years old, I joined the French army as a line infantryman, mainly to follow that beautiful general they call Napoleon Bone my part. I heard he could lead any army to victory and I wanted a piece of it. Just a piece. I'm Private Slamuel Johnson. And this is my story about the time during the time I went to war for a time with the French army. The first time I was in battle came at the siege of Fort Dario against the pasta drinking coffee eating Italians. As I tried to swallow the terror that was nearly overtaking me, oui, oui, ho, ho. I ran ahead with my attractive fellow Frenchmen. I soon, however, felt like a lost chicken with no penis. But then Lieutenant Mudskipper took control of the situation and led us forward. Everybody, let's charge A. Everyone, let's charge A. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You sound cute. I'm following you blindly. I have no clue what I'm doing. I'm coming. Neither do I. <laughs> After General Mudskip, Private Husk, and myself traversed across that frozen river, we realized our men had already taken a small forward turret, and we hopped up there like wet frogs. I soon found myself alone, under siege, and with no help in sight. Then one man used his wet frog legs to hop above me and around to the right flank. I attempted to follow but took a cannon blast to the face. Luckily I was hauled back to the doctors and they patched me right up. My second attempt at sieging those pasta loving Italians was much more effective as our army overwhelmed our enemy all while chanting vive la France. Ah. Ah. After killing many Italianos, I saw a couple of our men sneak around to the right flank, and I followed, only to discover something a bit odd. Oh, you guys know the Holy secret shit, path. After getting shot, I was once again taken back to the doctors who patched me up. My third attempt at taking down the pizza swallowing cappuccinos started well, as Mr. PP and I took down a rogue Italian. Nice shot, Mr. Pippi. Mr. Pippi. <laughs> Good work, Mr. Pippi. Merci bien. Vive la France! Then one of the hottest men I've ever seen told me to follow him, and I sure as sexy man did. We need more brothers to scale the wall. I'll scale your walls. Come, brother, come. Okay. Vive la France. Vive la France. What we're gonna have to do is scale the wall to the right hand side of C. For the left-hand side of C. That sounds hot. And after, it's pretty fucking hard. Hot. It'll, yeah, it is hot. There's a lot of bullets. You're hot. I didn't hear that. You heard me. Oh no, no, you're dead. The hot boy's dead. No. It didn't work out for that hot boy and I, 
but I still to this day think about him when I'm doing my top 10 hottest boys ever in my head. I did manage to make it back to the front lines in one piece by the grace of Jeebus. I met back up with the hot fellas and we pushed deep into the enemy fort. I got him. Push. Push sexually. We then met the final moment of the battle where we suicidally charged the enemy across a narrow bridge. All right, men, form a box line. We will cross the bridge in mass casualties. Let's go. Go. <laughs> Vive la France. We were French heroes, the alive and dead ones, all sexy as hell. After getting wounded for a fourth time, I thought to myself, damn, am I just sexy or do bullets love me? I decided I had enough of war and hung back to recover from my injuries, both physical and mental. Then I ran into these attractive men talking about something. Parlez-vous, parlez-vous français, parlez-vous français. Sapper boy. Don't fucking talk to me like that. Parlez vous I'll français. Take your chair away. Bro, I'm the boy, yeah, dude. I'll take your chair away. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, you deserve no chair, I'm bitch. The officer, bro. You never talk to me like that. Yeah, we never get in a chair again. Wow, well, bro. What's look up? At, look at Sex. here, man. Look at here. I want you all to see something. I built this man a chair and a table, and then he told me to go fuck this. No, I, I seen it. No, I, I seen it. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. They're lying, bro. The lion, bro, I swear, bro. See, watch, here you go. Now, now, now you need to sit down and, uh, and answer your yeah. invitations. We won, guys, all because of my master, Wayne. If I didn't give you all the information to win, no, sit down, we'd have lost, down, dude. dude. No, no, no. Um, could two, you please stop hammering me? That sounds a bit wrong, but like. Two, 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 two. Can I kiss you instead? Yeah, you can. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>